you're upset or you know if you're thinking about the future you're you're gonna be anxious and like worried and and you know just stay present stay and I have a hard time with that staying present but stay present you know try to remind yourself feel the air in your upper lip your breath um, look down where your feet are at the moment you know which a little of an illusion but again you know just stay present and refocus and then continue moving on okay we choose to stay stuck or move um, and and just relax so okay sorry I'm getting a little off track review and acknowledge your progress from a broader perspective so again just take the time to sit and look back at how far you've come okay what you've learned about yourself what you learned about the world what you're learning what maybe you uh, are feeling if you feeling like you are a career change or life change move ch you know a lot of change is um, going to be coming and you'll be feeling like you want to you know people are feeling different so it's just kind of recognizing that and and you know getting to know these new feelings and and learn yourself on an old and new level okay so anxiety huh, regarding the current situation is unfounded any halt in forward movement is temporary that's pretty good I hope so either way you know I know I'm okay um, this is a good time to rest or vacation to recharge your batteries see like I just said and I haven't even read this Usually I just get my messages from where I get them. This is really, this is the first tarot reading I've ever done, honestly, um, period. So, like, the cards were sticking together and stuff because I just bought them <laughs> before. So, like I said before, I got one of these elements. I really like them. I mean, I stuff with them. I put the energy through them. I clear the energy in them. Um, I'm a very good energy. Like, I, I know my energies and stuff. But uh, I felt a little um, phony to do the cards almost. I wasn't sure how those would necessarily work out. But I kind of decided to pretty <laughs> It's pretty cool. All right, so recharge your batteries, people. Additional meanings of this card. Perseverance. Reaching a milestone. Considering a new approach. Unnecessary worry. So again, just like think about creativeness and who you are and don't let anybody like be like, oh, you want to change whatever, you know, like tell you different. Don't even talk. Don't even like. Just chill with yourself. Trust yourself. Learn to trust yourself. Learn to listen. Listen to the divine. Connect. Because um, there's going to be a lot of new connecting going on. So just shh and like listen. You know, turn your TVs off. Um, have it quiet. Just try to get grounded and centered and just, again, who knows who they are anymore? You know, we're all running around all the time, got TVs on, kids have iPads, phones, whatever. You know, just like, shh, for a little bit and be quiet with yourself. It's okay. <laughs> World's not going to blow up. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, third card is Seven of Water. Okay. Sorry, my finger. So now, too, this is kind of whole solar system was in perfect alignment in like 225 million billion years whatever it was so that's like from the beginning of you know when the constantly when when the first story in the stars was kind of written um which i'll again get into in further videos but um because i've always watched the stars like again my last name is a star but what i started to see the last couple years and like start create you know what was going on in the sky i was like what and then uh, Anyhow, so that is a lot of my journey as well. So we have the seven. This reminds me of Pleiades, okay? So like I just said, our whole solar system was just in alignment. That included Pleiades, the sun, the moon, all of our planets, and the Spica star, um, which is really cool. I'll get into that all later again. But, uh, you know, this is just a really cool card. It says, a complex decision the need to do research and stop procrastinating, right? Like, should have had a V8. Uh, it's hysterical to me. So, again, um, you know, 
it's don't overthink. Um, we, we have these complex decisions to make right now because things are extremely changing. But it's, you know, it's going to be a gradual change. Nothing's going to be like, okay. Um, but it's going to be where, you know, it is where. Um, it's, 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 it's needing to. Because I just said sit and be calm. So, but be calm, but do your research within. Okay. And that's the stop procrastinating. Connect with what's really going on. Stop listening to um, all this false, uh, you know, false um, direction of fear to keep you in fear and not be in touch with yourself and your heart. And, and don't let people, you know, don't let uh, the outside control your insides. Okay, so seven of water. I gotta really hurry my ass up. I'm not even gonna be able to shower before I do this freaking workout. All right, seven of water. It's on page 87. So it says, okay, you may be faced with a complex decision and it's difficult to choose between the options available to you. Do the research necessary or seek counsel from a mentor. Oh, you seek counsel from, okay? Again, we all want to talk and co-mingle with each other. And so you have to be careful of other energies and other... Again, you're, you're trying to learn who you are, so you don't want to take in so much of what everybody else is telling you because then you're going to start doubting yourself and ba da 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 what is this, you know, should I believe that? If that's, that, that's the way to try to pick up and you're, you're, you're going to second-guess yourself and um, not stay where you're supposed to stay at. So... That is um, just an important tip to please keep in mind. Okay, protect yourself and and just and trust yourself. If you if you feel kind of a funny like meh, vibe from someone or or something you're listening to, trust that and 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 either move on from it or like I said, take what resonates with you. And if you get funky vibes, like change the channel. You know, like. I protect my phone, I protect my space, I protect myself. Um, so this is my first video, however, I'm gonna say right now I have protection on my feed, on myself, on where I am, my dwelling, my home, my um, people I love, and I surround myself with divine energy and protection um, because I do not allow, um, and I have, Okay, uh, but I'll conquer it with the light. Okay, so I protect myself. So I suggest you do the same. Okay, you protect yourself with 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 light coming into your crown, like a river flowing through you, out of your feet, coming around you like a bubble. You can do that around your house, around anything, and that is energy. We're all made of energy. You surround yourself with positive energy. Okay to to deflect negative energy you you use um a mirrored like I you would use like imagine a mirrored ball okay as my like one of my little totem animals okay spirit animals my squirrel okay uh you use picture a mirrored ball because negative energy will bounce off of that so you protect yourself with with light and and mirror mirrored energy okay and and again everything is polar polars so um it's understanding a lot of alchemy uh the way the universe works the original with the way that everything really works okay everything is a polar opposite everything as within as above so below okay you really have to understand that and that's again that's where we're going that's where eventually every you know that's the goal okay um to really understand that thoroughly because that that's the truth of who and what we are and where we came from and 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 pretty much everything so all right i got distracted off this reading here so it's time to stop procrastinating and get busy if you're drawn to a particular cup depicted on this card it's chakra color holds meaning and offers guidance as you're making your choices okay so i'll hold this up for you okay 
Um, I can't get into that. Uh, where am I? Red means home, money, and security. Okay, that's your root chakra. Orange means creativity, addictions, and sexuality. Okay, that's our sacral root chakra. Okay. Yellow means power and control. Okay, it's our solar plexus, which is your center there. Okay. That resonates with you. Green means love and healing. Okay. Light blue means communication and truth telling. That's our throat chakra. So that green is our heart. Okay. Light blue is our throat chakra. Dark blue means visions and psychic abilities. Okay. So that's that's our our third eye. Our, okay. When I say three eyes, I don't mean one, two, three. You're gonna see them like that again. You you feel love. You feel you know we have a soul. You feel intuition. Your third eye is the same. Okay. If you're watching this, you know that. So this is not believing everything you see with your physical eyes. Again, this is trusting and learning to connect, okay, with your heart from here, okay? Your inner being and your heart. Not logical brain always, okay? Um, okay, and then purple means spirituality, which, you know, amethysts and, okay? Try to focus and avoid unrealistic expectations. So again, do not put ridiculous pressure on yourself to like come to some kind of solution. Don't, you know, you, we manifest things, but like put it out there and you, you, you hold on to the fear, you're, you're going to manifest the fear too. So it's, it's, it's putting it out there and, and, and learning again, we're learning to trust ourselves. So that's what this is about. Additional meanings of this card. Too many options, confusion, fantasies, imagination, running wild, and fiction. So, okay, I can relate with all of those, um, you know, but um, I'll first say, like, I, I'm a complete alcoholic. I've been uh, alcohol-free over three years. So um, that was one of the other, you know, demons I've had to battle in my life around in my family, um, you know, dealing with spirits. Um, so, you know, again, it's, uh, ugh, I'm gonna have to probably, like, quit and come back here, but, um, confusion, fantasies, it's okay to have fantasies, we want to have them, we want to manifest things, but you don't want to get stuck in them where you're gonna disappoint yourself and then feel, like, upset and whatnot, so just, and, and let me tell you, when you start really connecting, <laughs> the, the reality is fantasy, okay? Believe me. So, last card. Bottom of the deck, okay. The seven of air. So remember I said we had all the elements. So we had the eight of fire, the seven of earth, the seven of water, and the seven of air. So eight, seven, seven, seven. I love it. Infinity and seven, seven, seven. That's so insane. So, plans that need revision. More going on that meets the eye. Four times four. Okay, so... You know, a lot of people were talking about union and all this stuff, union at the end of the year and the portal. And, um, yes, the portal's open, but again, things aren't like instant, okay? Um, I'm a feminine. I'm a twin flame. I've been in this for a long time. This is so uh, long in unraveling. And again, all of the things that I just keep rediscovering and learning and finding along the way, it's taken me so long, okay? So if, if, if you're masculine, um, and, and okay, I'm, I'm also very, um, on the masculine side, you know, like I said, I personal train, I'll kick someone's ass. I'm a tiny thing, but I will kick ass and in love. But you know, uh, I, um, I'm, I'm, I, I love being strong and I, um, I have a very masculine side of me, but I'm the most like loyal, loving person. So, you know, I, I understand that. You know, and our masculines, uh, you know, and it doesn't mean male, female, okay? Um, masculine energy is, is uh, you know, there's a lot going on. There's a lot of, again, more going on 